I think one of the core reforms we've decided to undertake as a government is to reform our healthcare system, particularly the basic healthcare system. And um, it's that where the, the reform stands on three legs. First, just ensuring that we reform or we re the rehabilitate the physical infrastructure. Uh, we are securing them, we are ensuring that they have 24 7 electricity. Uh, each facility must have water, a uh, borehole. And um, so, in terms of the physical space, the physical environment in which the workers work and the patients are received, we want to make sure that they're clean and they're um, standardized. The second part of the, the, the reform is to ensure that we have the systems, the technology that will capture the data of patients when they come in so that we have a record of each patient that walks through our primary health care center and we understand the uh, ailments, we can understand the challenges, um, in, uh, the health care challenges of the individuals in the community. The third bit will be the system to administer the drugs and the billing for the patients who come in. Ultimately, we want to put in place uh, uh, health insurance, a state health insurance program uh, that will help in paying for the services. The, precisely, this is one of the 20 pilot projects we're working on to just ensure that we understand the issues and um, standardize the, the, the product or the, the facilities. In terms of personnel, yes, we've also, um, we have, have a program where we're training and, and retraining the staff required to manage this system. We've trained the first 174 and our intention is to train um, about 2,000 of healthcare workers in the, in the local government, in the primary healthcare system. There's at least one in each local government. That is the, the basis of the pilot. The, after the pilot, we'll you know, look at all the learnings, the mistakes that have been made, the, you know, uh, what, how to ensure that we don't make those mistakes again, and then start a rollout of 200 of them. Every ward must have one of these sort of facilities in Edo State.